This course came flashing across my Twitter timeline thanks to a Miobi. And <laughs> the name definitely, I guess you could say, stuck out. I think what makes it even funnier is that it's all capitalized. I don't know why that has any bearing on what makes it funny to me, but yeah. I think that the name is the reason why I'm playing this course today. So we are going to head out to Big Muff, made by an Australian, and we are going to see what this course has in store for us today. I'm going to be playing from the tips. We are on round four pins. Defaults are firm, firm, and fast. Noon's the time of day. The weather is clear. I'm ready. Hopefully you're ready. Let's go dive headfirst into some muff. Look at this. Nice little trek along the ocean. We have a nice little helicopter pad to come in on since this is on an island. Looks like a little hotel resort over there. Okay. This actually looks really, really nice. Nice little clubhouse, little lighthouse on the top. Light your way in for the helicopter to land. Yeah. This looks like a really good setting. Make sure of some, I don't know, these are rocks, but, oh yeah, they are. All right, a little bit of rock faces in there. And a lush, 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 lush green throughout. Down ship. Good beaches. Okay. Yeah, I'm ready. The setting is uh, really nice. We start off with a gigantic elevation change. 74 feet down. Long par four. That elevation definitely helps. Makes it not quite as long. Oh, that's a dirty... Oh, we got back on. I was about to say, that's a dirty little landing there in the fairway. Got a big old fat hill to work with here. I think we can plunk this on down. We have a nice little landing zone. This is a, actually a tough little shot. We do not want to miss this right. We're going to miss it right because I slowed the hell out of this. What an idiot. Oh, what a loser. Interesting, uh, interesting first green. It is a sprawling green. Good spot for four pins, though. I feel like that's always a good thing to look at. Especially for tournament. Tournament courses. Can it do four pins nicely? Usually the first green gives you a good idea of what you're going to get, in that regard at least, for... The course. That was a good first hole. I think that was a really good tone setter hole, just to kind of give you like what you're gonna get into uh, for this course. That was uh, that was really nice. That was a good first hole. Liked it a lot. We're gonna be dealing with a lot of elevation changes though. That's for sure, because this is kind of like up a mountain. So we are gonna be dealing with it to the max. Which for me, I mean, good elevation changes, I think personally, makes the golf just play better. Nine feet up, get sneak it in there. Uh, not red fast in it though. We're gonna get on the green. Is it gonna get on this next level? Kinda? Does it hold? It holds, man. If I wouldn't have read fast of that, that probably would have been really good because we oh my god. This is terrifying. We would have used this entire hill coming back down. I don't even know what to do with this. I'm just gonna hit this up here. I don't know, dude. We'll just see what happens. If I can just get it close, you know, sure. This is probably gonna pick up so much speed though.
All right. Hey, I'll take that. Yep. Sign me up for it. Give me my birdie. I'll gladly move on to the next. First taste of a par three. Actually, really, this is really cool. They kind of look like animal prints. At least this one does. This one, not so much, but... I like this. These, like, little mini bunkers kind of woven in between the rock and the heavy rough. That's pretty cool. That's an interesting bunker. I don't have to think about that. I like this though a lot. It's a really, 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 really cool bunker style. I think the wind's gonna carry it a little bit past that. I think we'll be okay. Except I fasted it. Oh, it's definitely gonna get past. Hit pin. This will come back some though. We have, there's been a lot of like, uh, backstops in these holes. Hit this firm for a birdie. Nice. Okay, two under. Don't mind if I do. Don't mind if I do. Drivable par four? Uh, not quite. <laughs> maybe, maybe if we had a wind in her back. Definitely not now, though. We're just going to play this off. Just get us into either pitch or low end wedge. Sand gap would be nice. That rolled a lot. Probably gap. We're in the sand region. Again, backdrop. This is a dirty green if you miss it. So don't fucking miss it. Oh, we slowed it. Is it gonna, it's gonna come back and roll off where I don't want it to. Oh, eh, no, okay. It, it held. Not ideal, but it held. It was a nasty putt. It was a really nasty putt. Up the hill, down the hill. I had to be careful because the last thing I want is this that one to get away from me. You know, and we have a nine footer for par. That's I'm fine with playing the game of, you know, let's just get it within five and take home our par, especially after a bad shot like I had with that slow. I really like this hole. Look at this hole. The way this fairway actually comes in over here is really cool too. Yeah, I really like the this bunker style where it's like bunkers are it's almost what it kind of reminds me of is where like some sand would like blow off on a like a really windy day and blow off and kind of pool up somewhere else. I know that these are probably by design, but that's just kind of what it reminds me of. I just don't want to hit this hill firm. Man, I don't want to do this either, though. That wasn't the ideal shot. That was the ideal chip, though. Here we are. 
Sign me up for those. Ooh. This is a nice part five. Short, but huge dog leg up, a, up the hill too. That's gonna be a problem. I think this fast gets us at the tip of this hill, a little short, a little short. I do not think we can make it up here. Guess what? We're gonna try. Is there any OB? No OB, we're gonna try. This is gonna be close. I think the elevation is gonna be the killer. No? It's gonna make it. It's not gonna stop, but we're gonna have a chip in here. We got a chance. Nice little eagle. Okay, 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 okay. Let's see if we can do it. Come on now. And I slow it. Yep. And that was, uh, that is what killed it. Of course it is. We'll take a birdie. Hell with it. We'll take our birdie. Give it to me. Four under. Yep. Ooh, we're getting a little mix here. No backstop this time. That's death down there. God dang it. Hopefully it sits. It's firm, firm, fast, though. It's sad enough. Dang it. Uh-oh, SpaghettiOs. I overpowered it and fasted it. Okay. We can recover here from ni nicely, though. No ghost break. Hit me with it. Here we are. At least we saved it. We got another par 5 coming up. Let's see if maybe we can get an eagle on this one. Maybe? Well, the potential is there. Maybe not. That is uphill, too. Wonder if I can sneak it here. I know if I go right side, it wouldn't be good. We can't sneak it here. If we went right side, the way that that fairway it is all sloping away. So we'd have to probably short it or three wood it in. Yeah, I don't want to do that. I want to go for these. So... That's what we're doing. We are going to bring a slight fade into this. I don't know if we'll get the roll, but potentially we will. Nope. Uh, wind dated a little bit. The fade took way too much distance. I definitely didn't want to drive that there. We we hit a drive into that and that's that's ugly. The drive is very, very ugly there. Cause who knows where that's gonna stop. We could have ended over here, which would have been terrible. That would have been worst case scenario. Although Well No! No, God, please, no, no! Me pushing the shit out of the ball, too. Definitely doesn't help. Get our birdies. But I was going to say, though, if we did end up over there, right, for a putt, it would have been great content if we make that putt. <laughs> oh, look at this mammoth. 37 down. Roger. Slowed it. Fasted it. Excuse me? Does this pick up any speed? Okay. Okay. Hey. Smooth as butter. 
Mm. Mm-hmm. We are we have become kind of a downhill master. I've been hitting so many downhill putts, making my head spin a little bit. You know what? I kind of want to see what this looks like. If we cut it right over this hill. Oh, we slowed it. This is probably looking bunker. Mm, probably rough. Which is even worse. Especially going up this hill to the screen, which is elevated. Using a three iron. Yeah, I ain't gonna make it there. This is getting super greedy. Okay, imagine we make this putt. All right, listen. We have the distance to do it, okay? Do we count this all out? Do we count all this out? <laughs> Imagine we did. I'm not gonna lie, right now, I believe, okay? I just need all of you to believe as well. Oh my gosh, finding this distance. Fly. Fly. I did not just short it. <gasps> oh, boy. Oh, boy. Imagine we drained that, though. What was that, 140 footer? Oh, my God. I probably would have just got up Alt F4 out of OBS. <laughs> We could retire then. That's that's retirement level right there. We drain that sucker home. I'd be like, yep. Yeah. Good game, everybody. We had a good run. <laughs> we had a good run. We're just gonna ride off into the sunset. Especially as this rolls all the way down into the cup. On a terrible shot. Imagine getting bailed out. That would have been even better. I mean, we just, we did get bailed out, but I'm talking bailed out for a hole in one. That didn't break hardly at all. Also, we're not going to hit another hole in one. I got my one every two years, okay? It's, it's, it's done now. We won and done it. We got one. That's all we needed. I'm, I'm satisfied for the next 24 months. I'm glad I finally got a hold of a dev, told him to take out the respawn, can't get a hole-in-one code, and it came through for us. It came through for us. But now it's back in, you know, back to reality. All right, we're about to make a golf shot here, okay? I'm going to hit it up this hill, right? We're going to run it all the way back down, and it's right into the cup. It's definitely going to roll down, but it is going to be well to the left. Maybe even off the green. I did want it. Ay, 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 ay. Oof, scared me. That definitely scared me. Ooh, drivable part four. Hole in one. This is tough. You gotta hit pin. That's for sure. This might be okay. Too much speed. Yeah, that fast killed it. The wave is probably definitely just playing that off to the right and taking your lumps. Oh, 
Oof. That was ugly. Well, we have a chance at our birdie. Okay. I mean, I'm feeling pretty confident right now. Ooh, par 71, too. I really like these sweeping dog legs that are put in here. These are really, really nice. Especially using the elevation to those dog legs. Very good. I'm also usually not like the hugest of fan of of like rolling hilled fairways and courses. Uh, but these work pretty good. Actually, don't mind these. This is a this is a wild ass green. Don't hit a bad shot. 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 Oh man, off the slope too. And come off nearly right enough. It should sit up on this first plateau though. This is gonna be a tough putt, but. We got up onto the plateau, so that's really, that was half the battle. Just got to make sure we don't hit this too hard. Oh. Front sided me. Not a bad read, just... Scared to take the hill too fast, and that just led to a miss. It's bound to happen. It's a short side green. But we should be wedge territory, so that won't be a problem. Which is good. I, I like when that is taken into account. Sometimes you see these really short side greens like this, where it's very small distance-wise. If you have to bring, like, a 5-iron into some of these, it just doesn't play very good. Uh, I'm glad when people take that into account, where it's like, alright, I'm gonna, I'm not gonna give you too much green to work with, but I'm gonna make it so you can you bring in a wedge, you know? I like that. This is good golf. That's thinking of the little things. Getting the hole. Oh. It's just the, the, the little things about a good round of golf, at least to me. Here we are. Get good shots, get rewarded with your putts. Who would have thought? Who would have thought? Another drivable par four? Ooh. <laughs> Kinda. Alright, hear me out, okay? We're gonna fade this in, right? It's gonna come right through here. It's gonna hit, right? It's gonna go up the hill. Okay, it's gonna roll along the top, and it's gonna roll all the way back down, right? And then it's gonna come around like this. It's gonna use this slope too. Funnel back to the hole, hole in one. Watch and learn. Watch and learn. All right, let me show you how it's done. Okay. Step one, complete. Okay, we're going the wrong way here. <clears throat> I don't want to look at this putt. All right, hear me out. Hear me out, okay? We're going to put it over here, okay? It's going to go up the hill slightly. Around, back down the hill, into the cup. <laughs> Watch and learn. All right. <clears throat> yep. Yep. This is it. Oh, this is it. Uh, I actually have a really good feeling about this. Okay, a little frame lag. Let's not do that.
nailed it. So I didn't quite hit that hard enough. <laughs> Thought that was going to pick up a little bit more speed. It it uh, it did not. <laughs> it, it definitely uh, didn't pick up the speed we were looking for. That's for sure. But hey, there's always next time. There's always next time. <laughs> and then we front side the birdie putt. Oh, come on. Come on. Don't do me like that. Ending on a par five. Beautiful. This is a deep ass par three. Holy shit. This hill should kind of work to our our advantage. Hopefully, don't pick up too much speed. It picked up speed. Yeah, it's down the backside. Oh, this is going to be another nasty putt. Hit good shots, get rewarded with your putt. Hit bad shots, have nightmares. All right, up the hill, down the hill. Up the hill, down the hill. That'll work. We should be able to make that. Little five footer. All right, onto the par five. Let's see if we can get an eagle here. I've definitely been searching for one. We want all the fairway we can work with. Definitely want to get it as high as we can, too. Uh, this should still be okay. If it funnels down to the left into that bunker, we're screwed. Nope, we're good. We're good. And this gives us a bunch, a bunch of fairway to work with over here to the right. This is a really cool hole. I think this is a really good fitting uh, hole to go out on. This is going to be good. This is going to be real good. Just Galba. Ah, oh, just didn't pick up enough break. Okay, hey. We got a chance on an eagle here. We got a really good chance on an eagle. We just got to make this bender. We've made him before. Add a little bit more going up this. That's got a break. Oh. Man, I just didn't get the break in my feet that I wanted. We finished with a birdie, though. Still a pretty solid card. That was a hell of a course. Yeah, sign me up for that. That was really good. I'm amazed that it has three and a half stars. I, I thoroughly enjoyed that. I really enjoyed that. I'll give it a little bit of a boost here. I think it definitely deserves it. I think that was good. I think that was good golf. Honestly, just all together, that was good golf. I think the setting was good. I really like the elevation changes. You know, they, there was sprawling fairways, which would probably be the only knock is that like you had these sprawling fairways. So, I mean, I had 92% fairway in regulation and I didn't hit the greatest of drives. So that kind of nullifies the elevation distance wise. But I think that the elevation still worked good and... I guess some people would say that maybe the greens were a little, like, extreme, but it was only if you hit really bad shots. That's what got you into trouble, and I don't mind that if you hit really bad shots. Some courses punish you for hitting bad shots. Overall, though, I thought that was a great course. That was a very, 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 very good big muff. Go and give it a play. Let me know what you think of it. But for me, today, I am out of here. Thank you so much for stopping by. Greatly appreciate it. Hope you have a great rest of your morning, afternoon, or evening, wherever you are in the world. I will catch you on the next one. Bye.